Hi, this is Manish. Today I'm going to tell about uh, mapping variable and how to perform CDC using mapping variable. So scenario is like uh, this is uh, our source table and this is target table. Source table and target table having same structure. So first time the all, all records should move to the target like in first iteration 10 to 40 department from 10 till 40 department should load to target in second iteration suppose this bi is, is near record that should only move to the target only the last record should move to the target go to mapping designer for this I have uh, already created source structure and target structure you can see uh, department CDC is source structure and it, it is having data till 40 and batch 11 this department CDC TGT is uh, our target table currently it has uh, no data click on designer and import your source definition and target definition I have already imported source definition, source definition and target definition just go and click source and import from database and import the structure for target uh, to do same thing you should have a DSN created now click on a mapping designer create new mapping um, underscore so what we are going to do CDC with mapping variable okay now click your uh, drag and drop your source definition so department CDC is our source definition now click on uh, click your expression double click on source qualifier go to properties tab and generate S do generate SQL so here in SQL override we will apply this uh, CDC concept so where so we are applying CDC concept basically on department number so every time when new department will insert uh, uh, th that will have a maximum number of uh, maximum number like first time uh, it has uh, 10 to 40 next time it will be 50 so next uh, next time it will be 60 70 so only maximum value will assign to this department number for new record so I'm taking this department number greater than dollar dollar variable last max department number click ok apply it so we have already created uh, we have already gave condition in a source qualifier just go to mapping and define a variable here so type is variable so it should have uh, integer data type and initial value make it zero now just track uh, now just double click this expression and add one more port this will be a variable port which will assign maximum value of department number so max department number I'm assigning to variable so it should have data type uh, integer click variable port so how to define 
um, mapping variable how to uh, uh, insert data into mapping variable or assign data into the mapping variable so informatic uh, you cannot you cannot directly assign uh, uh, using equal to operator you have to use informatica inbuilt function so go to set function so you can see here uh, informatica have uh, set max set count set minimum variable set variable so max variable i have to take so double click your max variable and first input will be your mapping variable so in this port what i'm exactly doing i'm assigning value into mapping variable and what value department number and what kind of value maximum value just validate it now drag and drop your target table okay <clears throat> now go to workflow take uh, your mapping so m underscore cdc mapping variable is mapping which is created by created for uh, cdc click ok now double click your session properties go to mapping give correct the uh, relational connection for cdc it will be batch just run your workflow sorry I have run a wrong mapping uh, let me delete the record this is the workflow we have created now only restart this workflow so let me check uh, so uh, four records got inserted into the target you can see uh, run a statistic just uh, validate this in database so this four record got inserted into the target this i want to wanted to show a uh, current value of the variable so right click your session properties and go to view persistent value so here uh, you can see your last value last max value so 40 is assigned to this variable because last time 40 was the max value of department number and that got assigned to this variable now uh, what i want to do to do uh, i'm just changing uh, source i'm just adding one more record into source uh, table fifty bi india committed so i have uh, inserted 50 uh, department number into source table again i will run same uh, workflow i just wanted to check whether our uh, uh, cdc is uh, working properly or not so this this time it should uh, load only one record so you can see here uh, one record got inserted let me verify in, in the target table
so 50 bi india my spelling is wrong uh, so it got inserted into the target uh, so now you can see a uh, current value should be should be 50 so you can see a uh, 50 value is in in the map in the mapping variable and if you want to see your uh, source query get session log go to get go to session log and just check whether here you can see uh, in this query select department cdc department number from department cdc where department number greater than 40 so this 40 this uh, cdc is working properly by seeing this uh, sql query you can easily identify it because it's taking last uh, maximum value so third time you, again if you want to insert just go to source just add one more data having value 60 now I will write correct name it's a type of mistake last time so I have uh, added one more record just let me verify again one uh, record got inserted uh, let me check uh, the session properties now it should be greater than 50 the query should have this logic you can see here so department number is greater than 50 mm, let me verify in the target table Sixty record got inserted thank you